This is John with Tadlock Roofing. I'm at 410 Inglewood Drive here in Tallahassee, Florida. And <clears throat> what we have here is a 212 three tab system which slopes down to the back to meet a completely flat, um, what once was a mod bit roll roof that has turned, been coated with, can't tell if it's acrylic or silicone base, but um, definitely probably a 20, 25 year old three tab system. We are losing adhesion very brittle, uh, very emulsified, and nail pops, adhesion, it's just definitely time. And there's also a couple uh, things I wanted to point out. These are three inch PVC penetrations here. We have a, appears to be a rotten section here, and a fairly new skylight here. As you can see the shingles around it. This is what a this is what a newer shingle looks like here and you can tell that they're flexible whereas you can hear how crunchy that is um, I did a good job on this um, but then we have this over here as well got a hole going on right here and the, the rotten this whole soffited area about a Two foot softened area on the underside here has completely fallen off. And what's going on is when they sealed out this flat area, they did not cut back their perimeter. That lifts right up and goes right up underneath. That's why the soffit is laying on the ground down there. Um, so we want to absolutely address that. We want to cut back this perimeter, seal it down. Um, this feels structurally, it's, it's pretty solid out here, so we can absolutely clean this up and reapply a new coat over the top of it. Um, and there is gutter around, so we'll have to address that as well. But again, with the perimeter, lifts right up. You know, water's getting right up under that. So, again, we have a 212 coming down that meets a completely flat. And you can see at this transition where there had been recent work done. One, two, three, four shingles up all the way down this transition here. But hopefully that encompasses everything and gives you a better idea of what's going on up here. Also, we may need to go ahead and get a new gas stack put in as this one looks pretty old. All right, thank you for your time.